my name is Kate Zeidler. I'm a residential interior designer in Toronto. And my room, 310, is called the best room. I was asked um, to create a room that would be suitable for um, people who might be staying for an extended period of time in the hotel. So I wanted it to be very subtle and very quiet, but yet rich and interesting. There's sort of three separate areas. There's the, the dining area, there's the sort of lounge area, and then there's the bed area. All the materials are natural fibers, and I just want it to be very sort of sumptuous and warm, but not overbearing visually. Also, all the lighting that I used was, is hanging. It's a fairly narrow space behind uh, where the bed is because it's a, sort of a, what I would describe as a, a nook, which is kind of nice and cozy. As I say, if they wanted to live here for a week or two weeks, then they could uh, maybe go out for most meals, but could have a lunch or a breakfast or you know a very simple supper here if they wanted to. It has a microwave, a sink, and a fridge, and knives and forks, and you know plates and glasses, so that if you did want to prepare a meal, you could. And this is a beautiful oriental carpet um, that just, again, the art and the carpets, all the fabrics that I chose are all virtually monochromatic, so it keeps it very, I love monochromatic interiors because it keeps them very calm and restful and they're easy to live in. You have to remember with interior design, you don't want things to be trendy. This room was done four or five years ago and I still think it looks like it could have been done yesterday. To me, the Gladstone is a wonderful place because no matter who you are or where you come from, you feel good being in this building.